Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a little while since I've done like a styling try on video. So today I'm gonna do more of a styling video instead of just trying on a bunch of stuff. And I'm gonna do five outfits and I'm gonna use the jean jacket, my favorite jean jacket, this guy right here, in all of the, in all the outfits. So let's get to it. Well, let me show you first of all. We're gonna just use these items right here and then this bag. Keeping the colors pretty like monochromatic, just doing a lot of stripes, whites and blacks, and even a little bit of greens because I've been just like loving like olive green, like these pants. Loving these. I wore these on my trip to Colorado and they're like the most perfect travel pants. So anyways, let's get right into the try on and I'll show you guys everything. Okay, so the first outfit is obviously the one that I have on already. It's just super basic with these cozy travel pants, my Birkenstocks, which I wear all the time. This super comfy, I don't know how to describe it, but like it's really stretchy material, v-neck top, and then the denim jacket, and then this adorable necklace that I've been wearing like all the time when I can, because Emma will grab it. But it's really cute because it's 19 bucks and you can get all three pieces. But I think this is always a good way to wear a denim jacket just because I don't like to mix necessarily jean with jean, but if you're wearing like a cargo pant, or a legging or something like maybe a linen pant or um, joggers, something of that nature. I think it can be really cute with a denim jacket. Excuse the boxes, this room is not set up yet. I'm hoping to do a really cool like closet situation behind me. Future plans. Anyways, this top fits true to size. I have it in a size small. I didn't it size down because I like that it's a little bigger so I can front knot right here. The jacket I actually sized up to a medium. I like, like the way it fits with stuff under it so you can fit more things under it. And then the pants, surprisingly, I sized down to an extra small in these and they fit perfect. And then Birkenstocks are kind of weird with sizing. They always have, like if you Google Birkenstock size comparison chart or whatnot, it'll tell you what European size to get. I think I'm an eight and a half and I think I get a 39 in the Birkenstocks. And the one thing about them is they take a while to mold to your feet. So when you first put them on they're gonna feel a little bit strange but trust me like keep wearing them and they get so amazing they'll actually like form to your feet and you'll never want to wear another pair of shoes <laughs> okay i also wanted to show you the outfit without the jacket so you can see how the shirt looks it's just easy comfy you can wear this shirt with like so many things you can wear it with white jeans or shorts and then just bring the jacket with you for when you get chilly okay i <laughs> I'm gonna change this up a little bit because I want to show you, I just changed my pants, but I feel like it's really cute to wear this with white jeans too, and the denim jacket goes really well as well. I'm gonna try on a couple other striped tops, but I wanted to show you guys this top look like with these white jeans. These are actually from American Eagle, and they're like my favorite white jeans. I got a lot of questions on these when we were in Colorado. People like couldn't believe that they were from American Eagle, but they're so cute, but they have really good jeans lately. And these, I, I stuck to my normal size, which in American Eagle is usually a four, but if it's a boyfriend jean, I'll size down one size to a two. I'll show you guys this with the denim jacket over it too, one second. Okay, so here it is with the denim jacket. I just feel like this is a really nice color palette for summer, easy, light, super cute. I'm gonna show you guys with the bag too. I keep forgetting to include the bag. One second, I'll show you with the bag. This is like the easiest bag just because you can wear it as like a shoulder bag, a crossbody bag, or you can just use the little handles. Let me show you. See? So cute. This one's going a little crazy. There we go. Really cute. And it, I'll show you with the shoes behind me. This bag goes really well with those. But if you just want to wear like any sort of sandals and then keep it like, you can keep it casual. Or if you want to dress it up, do wedges. I really love this bag, it's so cute. I've been looking for a long time for like a really good straw bag and this one is just the best because I feel like it can be worn so many different ways. Okay, this is one of my favorite dresses. I think I got it like, I don't know, two years ago and it comes in a ton of colors, but it's just a good dress because you can make it casual. Like you can dress it kind of casually, like I'm just wearing my Birkenstocks right now, or you can dress it up a little bit like with the wedges that I'll show you guys too. It goes really well under a denim jacket and it actually looks really cute with this necklace too. I feel like I need to adjust this one one more. You can adjust it like multiple lengths, so I might do like one more to make it a little bit longer. But I just like this is like a great option for like happy hour or dinner. Like if you want to dress it up a little more, then you can wear wedges. You could even do like white or black or I'm going to show you guys 
those wedges with the brown bag real quick. For this dress, I got a size small. I'd say it runs pretty true to size, but if you're in between sizes, I would size down. I'll show you the dress without the jacket here in a second too. Okay, so I hung the jacket up so I could show you guys just the dress. Go a little bit closer so you can see. It's a really pretty dress, really basic. Can be worn like with everything. And they have a ton of colors in this dress. It's kind of like a crepe, they call it a crepe material. So it doesn't wrinkle, which is great. And it's long enough in the back. It's like longer in the back than it is in the front, which I really like. I was gonna say it'd actually be cute with just these two necklaces, because you can actually take this one off. It's like, they all come separate. It's like one for $19.99, but you can just wear two or all of them, whatever you wanna do. Let me show you guys this with the wedges and the bag and the jacket. Okay, so this is an adorable outfit. Pardon my band-aid. <laughs> We were in Colorado and I like leapt across the floor to save Emma. She was about to fall backwards. So um, I skinned my knee, so that's why that's happening. But I feel like this is adorable with the wedges because the wedges go really well with the bag and this whole outfit just ties together perfectly. I feel like this is like the perfect like summer date night or like happy hour outfit. Super casual, but super cute. And then these two accessories just kind of pull it together and everything really blends super well. These wedges, I sized up half a size. So just FYI on that, a lot of people think that they run small, which I guess I would agree with that. They do run a little small. So I did size up from an eight and a half to a nine. And yeah, this is super cute. I really love this outfit. I'm like, I need to take a picture of this for Instagram. But anyways, I love this outfit. Perfect date night or happy hour. And the best, you know, an easy way to wear a denim jacket because you can just toss this on or you can go without it. Either way, it's a good thing you can just, you know, that's what I love about the denim jacket. I think it's casual, but it's cute, and it's just an easy thing to bring along with you wherever you go. Okay, so if you hear a lot of squeaking, that's Emma's toy. She's been like squeaking her toy. But anyways, I just wanna show you guys this without the jacket, with the wedges, and the bag. Super cute, perfect for date night or for happy hour. Just love this dress so much, it's so flattering. I really need to clean my mirror. Probably should have done that before this. Okay, so this is probably one of my favorite outfits. I wore, let's see, I wore, this part, let's see, I wore the top and the jeans and I wore them with Birkenstocks to an event that we had when we were at the GoPro thing in Colorado. But I feel like this is just perfect because this is like the perfect, another perfect like date night or happy hour or just going out with friends kind of outfit. I love this peplum top like so much. It's actually a tank and it's v-neck and it's really flattering because it's lower in the back. So it's not like a pregnant peplum top, but it looks really cute under the denim jacket and it comes in a ton of colors. I really want to snag it up in black because it's just like such a good basic that you can wear like for years to come. And I'm wearing the same jeans, same shoes, same bag, just change the top underneath. So another really cute way to wear a denim jacket, really casual, cute, like looks like you're trying, like looks like you tried, but you're not trying too hard. <laughs> you know? So anyways, I love this top. For sizing, I size down on this top to an extra small. So if you're in between sizes, go down because it does fit a little bigger. So I'll show you guys it without the denim jacket too. Okay, so here's what it looks like without the denim jacket. See how cute it is? It's really flattering. I keep trying to put my hand in my pocket and I realize these pants don't have a pocket. <laughs> I wear them all the time and I don't know how I didn't remember that. Anyway, so here's how the top looks. It's a little longer in the back. So cute. Seriously, one of the most flattering tops. And I love it with this necklace. It'd be cute in any color with white jeans for summer because they have so many cute colors. Let me show you a little closer up. So, so cute. And it's under 50, I think it's like 49 bucks. Sorry, I just really love this cute little top. It's like the perfect dressier top. I think you could wear it like, you know, out like I said, or you could even do it like wear it at the office under your denim jacket, or you could even do like a blazer with it if you have to dress up a little bit more for work. I think that could be really cute too. Okay, so another way to wear a denim jacket is I'm wearing the same things on the bottom, but I just changed out my top to a v-neck tank, which is really similar to the peplum tank I was just wearing, but this one's just more casual and basic. This is how it looks. Had a little pocket. They make these tanks in a ton of colors. They're the Madewell tanks and it's just super cute. I like the stripes, kind of nautical for summer. So this would be obviously dressing it up a little more because I have on wedges. It, this actually will look really cute with the bag as well. Or you could dress it a little more casually and just do white Birkenstocks and like a tote bag or something. But this is really cute, very festive. Could be like a 4th of July outfit. You did like some red nails, maybe not. Well, yeah, that'd be cute. 
or like a little, um, I have like American flag scarf, like a little head scarf. That can be a really cute 4th of July outfit. Anyways, I'm going off on a tangent, but this is really cute together. Okay, so I wanted to show you the tank without the jacket. I think for this, I would actually size down. This is actually a size small, but it is a little bit big here on like the armpit area. So I think if I would have gotten extra small, it would have been the perfect fit. But yeah, these are just really good layering tanks. I love the pocket. I love the V-neck. Mine's a little wrinkly, but you know, probably should have steamed it. Anyways, this is just a good tank top and it comes in a ton of colors. So um, I need it in a couple more. I also have like the t-shirt version of this tank, which is great. I wear it all the time, the gray one, but yeah. They have this in red too, I think. That'd be another cute 4th of July option. Okay, last outfit, and this might be my favorite. I tucked in and did a little front tuck on this Free People top. I love this Free People top. It's so comfy and oversized. Make sure to size down one size in this top, but you can wear it like this. I think it's so cute. Or if you wanna dress it down, sorry about the squeaks. If you wanna dress it down and do like Birkenstocks and a tote bag, you could do that as well. So super cute and casual. Just a really fun summer outfit. But yeah, let me show you this top without the jacket too, because it's really cute. Okay, so here's what the top looks like without the jacket. So cute, it's oversized, comes in a lot of colors, but I love it and it looks really cute with this necklace too. So dress it up with some wedges, you could do the bag or just do like Birkenstocks, flip-flops and like a tote or a clutch or whatever. So cute, let me show it to you guys. Okay, so that's it for today's video. I hope that I helped inspire you guys to mix and match some things in your wardrobe and kind of wear like, you know, use what you have and kind of create some different outfits or if you have a good denim jacket, just different ways to wear it. Or hey, this one is like the best ever. So if you're looking for a new denim jacket that you can wear for summer, highly recommend this one. I just love the wash. Sorry, I'm still getting used to using this camera. Anyways, I'll see you guys on my next video. If you like these kind of styling videos where I'm all over the place, hopefully I'll get better at this. Give this video a thumbs up so I know that you guys like these kind of videos. Leave a comment below and always feel free to subscribe to my channel. That way you do get notified if I have a new video that goes live. All right, I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching.